The Benefits of Trading Futures, sponsored by CME Group and Ninja Trader. Traders and investors, an important thing to know about futures is that some products are physically settled and other products are cash settled. In today's quick video, I'm going to be speaking with team lead of trading operations at Ninja Trader, Mike Sinto, about the differences between physical and cash settled futures contracts. Mike, please explain to all the traders and investors out there the difference between physical and cash settlements and futures. Hey, Anthony, yeah, I mean, there's this is one of those topics that, you know, they'll have important implications for your trading, depending on which products you're trading, just because of the way the futures contract ends, right? So we know every futures product only has a set lifetime. So like your equity products, the ES, the NQ, they settle every quarter. So when they settle, the exchange is just going to print a final price on the last day that they're traded. So let's say I'm long an ES at 3000 and when the December contract expires, it's trading 3300 If I still own my ES contract all the way through expiration, the exchange, the clearing firm, your broker, they're going to put that 3300 on my statement and match it against my 3000 long position. And then I'll see the profit of those 300 points in my account over the coming days. Now a physically settled product, that's something that you can actually be delivered upon or take delivery of the product. So think like you know, natural gas, crude oil, gold, those are items you can actually physically feel and touch. And those are products that should you carry them through the expiration or the expiry of the product, you can actually be assigned or delivered those products. So when you're looking at a deliverable product and as they are called, you want to be no wary of the first notice or the last trade date. And you want to have your products or your trades out of those products before those dates. So again, those are the kind of the difference. Physical, you should think you can physically touch and accept delivery. And cash is they're just going to mark a profit and loss to your statement at the end of the product. Mike, thank you so much for explaining to all the traders and investors out there the difference between physical and cash settlements. Mike did a wonderful job at explaining the difference between a physical and cash settled futures contract. So remember, traders and investors out there, know if your futures contract is physically or cash settled before expiration. Thank you so much for watching The Benefits of Futures.